whether they are already at that level of data science. The Deputy Solicitor General, who was also the chief guest, Dr. Marcella Ouma, pointed out on the importance of ethical business practices. The industry, basically, I say at the time when I started off, that's the time when we had, I think, serious chaos within the industry. We saw the collapse of some of the biggest insurance companies, courtesy of the transport sector. And I think as time has gone by, I am 100% sure that most of the, these particular companies came out, came down, and one of the contributing factors was unethical uh, behavior, especially from the leadership. So these are some of the things that I think we learned from the past. So enhancing uh, ethical leadership to, for growth and sustainability is a topical issue. So it's not just very specific for the insurance industry. For some of us in government, this is something that is very pertinent. And I think practically everywhere we are going through, we are looking at issues of ethical leadership. Mobile services for banking. Technology is a constant in business. And to this, Richard Gitonga, the director of Matrix Black Box Limited, pointed out to the industry players the importance of adapting new technologies. Smartest people, I remember we used to have what we call the smartest people in Singapore at that time, they had never anticipated that a platform or a business model from a different industry, more so telecommunications, would come into the banking industry and disrupt the entire industry. And more so, they could not have even anticipated that that disruption would come from Kenya. That is in the form of a, of a, of a platform called M-Pesa, isn't it? We had not anticipated it. Effective coverage. He challenged the stakeholders to have a vision for digital excellence in the strategic plan as it's a crucial factor to the industry remaining relevant. I need to challenge you because I can see some leaders in this room. Um, if you do not have in your strategic plans right now a vision for digital excellence, you need to review your strategic planning. You can talk about digital operationalization of your business, but you need a vision that embraces digital excellence. And hopefully by the end of this session, in the next 45 minutes or so, you'll see how critical that is. Also the moderator. He continued to state that though the insurance sector is yet to experience major technological disruption, the players must be prepared for this eventuality. So please, when we talk about disruption, it's a very real thing. And I can assure you, as the insurance industry continues at the rate at which it's continuing, there are people working night and day trying to figure out how to disrupt it. That's what happened in banking. And it will probably come from a dimension, a direction you never ever perceived. And that's the reality of industry. As the industry celebrates 70 years of speaking in one voice, plotting for the next 70 years is just as crucial. It is clear that ethics and technology, the glue that holds it all together, are sure great starting points. For Bram Plus TV Business News, I am Daisy Wambua.